Hello my friends and welcome to the next episode of this uh, of the return of the real Salzburg I'm happy that you joined me today we have three results to catch you up on first of all against Neumacht we beat them 2-1 just after our episode our last episode um, then we went to bottom team Salgao I think it was second bottom when we played them we beat them 4-0 uh, quite easy um, and in the last game we beat this team with 0-1 this team being Puch. Um if you can see um, or as you can see in our lineup here there's no Muhammad Ergodan that is because it has finally happened the thing I dreaded the most has happened we have got an injury on one of our main players but Meyer came in and played a good one um, and that is that today we are playing Zal, Zal MC and then we are uh, and then we are playing Hallein so 11th and 8th in the league uh, with this bit of form <coughs> excuse me um, with this bit of form we are currently parked at the third place of the league um, closing up on the two top teams so with two victories today we could actually end the episode top of the league hopefully but if we look um, here in the team um, I don't think we can play Ergudan really yet so um, Meyer and this guy gets another go so here we are ladies and gentlemen Austria at home against Zelamsi how's our assistant doing not good at all his team talks are is not his strongest bit and not mine either so I actually probably will look to get a new one new assistant not new team talks or technically both we're actually playing away we're <laughs> so that's fantastic professional youtuber right there for you and uh, also if you wonder why i struggle to say the names in some games or read some of the team names sometimes quickly or take some breaks it is because i'm visually impaired or partially excited how you want to phrase it it's completely up to you i am i'm doing my best to read the things and comment as quickly as i can um sometimes it's just not quick enough and sometimes something gets in the way um also the austrian some of the austrian and german surnames are just completely out of orderly weird here's the first actually highlight of the first half um, where we had the throw in but we lost the ball now we want it back as our um, defenders actually do some defending for once on the highlight our well, left wing back has the ball crosses it inwards towards Erdogan hey, Erdogan passes in towards Omerovic Omerovic scores and I, double, and I double checked I said it so conf confidently and it was actually Omerovic who scored um, I know he should be around there and he did score 0-1 and at the minute we're second in the league we are coming are you feeling our breath in your neck Red Bull Salzburger Salzburger that's not what they're called right uh, <laughs> they're um, Red Bull Salzburg um, yeah let's go with him that didn't work at all whatever uh <laughs> it's kind of funny to see uh, for example this like i can't read what the thing's gonna say like i'm partially sighted like i said i can't see what the he's gonna say so it is a lottery for me as well imagine you putting your uh, like closing your eyes and just pressing that button and then you see the reactions and you can see sometimes there's nothing sometimes there's lots of red next time it's lots of green it's quite it's quite fun otherwise i could uh, what i do i, I have um remembered memorized it's called 
wait a second, we come here on the right, on the right wing, but he gets uh, tackled and the ball goes out to a throw in. Uh, yeah, I have memorized where they're like having a go at them and praising them is located and everything in between. If I don't think they deserve anything of them too, then I just let the assistant do the team talks. Um, here's a cross in towards Ayu Perdoan, but it gets headed out, but we have a penalty for Austria Salzburg. Um, Utti takes it, Utti steps up, Utti runs towards the ball and scores! 2-0! For Austria Salzburg, and we are still second in the league. <laughs> Not only, but we are in control of this game, and it looks fantastic at the minute. But just because I say so, I'm gonna jinx it. I'm gonna lose next game 6 0 or something stupid like that. Ayo Perdon has the ball at the edge of the area, but it gets uh, hoofed away by the Zalemsi defense um, and that was a pointless hoof from our center back he gets it back uh, the wing the, our left wing back gets it back uh, also when I um, when I do personalize my team a bit more and like buy my own players and stuff and learn the names for example I like I learned Ayuperdoan Omerovic and Ergudan quite easily and I know about where about on the pitch they are so when I buy some players and when I personalize, I personalize myself more with the team, I am going to get uh, better at the live comps as well. I hope, anyway, <laughs> if I'm still as bad as I am now, then uh, maybe I'll let someone else do the comment or something. But yeah, and we just conceded. Uh, we just can't have a clean sheet on camera. Uh, well, we can hardly have it off camera either. Uh, but the YouTube curse is on our defense. And we only have 24. Is it 24? Yeah, only only 24 away fans. Which is a bit worrying that the fans have stopped coming. Maybe I should actually make one or two substitutions. Uh, but here we are at the edge of the area. Uh, passes it in. Uh, and they hoof it away. And they counter attack now. They are countering two against one. He's passing it backwards for some reason. But now it goes into the middle, shoots, and he shoots it wide, thankfully. That was a horrible shot from their player. Um, we have one center back. Do we have a left back? Yes, we do. And we can also substitute. Uh, no, we can't. Uh, not him. I wanted him Angerer out and Pauler in triple subage and uh, they have a corner oh, yeah. I did say that I jinxed it when I said it looked good and they are attacking and thankfully they wasted another sitter. He was heading it at the front post, just a few meters from the goal line. They went out. Now they have the ball on their left wing. Crosses it in. Goes to the back post. And nothing. Oh, penalty, it seems. Penalty now for ZMC. <laughs> the joys of having a visual impaired commentary, guys. And... Yeah, there's a goal, 2-2, two, two. I spoke too soon, we, as I said, we had control over the game. But yeah, as you can see, that's what you can expect. You can expect um, saying there's nothing happened when there's a penalty and stuff. That's what you can expect with a visually impaired commentary. We have the... Oh, there's a goal! There's a goal! Omerovic, what a hero! I just thought it was going to be a scramble or something, but Omerovic has put us up 3-2 at the end of this game. And we are winning once again. Vimpisinger uh, just passes it to the left back. Why didn't he listen to the team instructions and make a long goal kick? Nobody knows. Probably not even himself. And it can cost us dearly, but it doesn't because Vimpisinger plucks that 
um, that pass uh, easily. Hoof it up now. Once again, he just passed it out. It does say that he's meant to do long kicks, but he doesn't. But in the end, we win 3 2 against ZLMC thanks to Omerovic, who has started to um, contribute more and more. He had a bit of a down period uh, last few games. Mm, like on camera, I think he's been okay uh, since we last was on camera. Actually, this game, <laughs> just for uh, a bit of fun information, is that we um, we played this game 1st of December 2018, which is tomorrow, actually. So, um, yeah, we're one day in the future. <laughs> Uh, we'll be back for the next game, uh, which is against Halein. They are seventh, we are second. It's going to be a good one, so um, please join me for that in a second. I'm just going to play through these few days off camera, and I'll be back with Halein. So, ladies and gentlemen, it's time to welcome the green and white stripes of Halein to our um, stadium, Austria Stadion. Look, we are playing with Meyer and with Pukabek on the wings. Uh, Erdo, uh, Ergudan is still out injured. Erdogan is obviously on the pitch. Omerovic starts. Um, Anger Erotti and the horrible, the horrible back line in front of um, this guy. That I forgot the name. This Pissinger or something like that. Um, yeah, we go again against Halein. We are third in the league. We did drop down um, just the day after the last game because somebody won, and obviously then they had more points than us. So we're third. They're I think still seventh. And let's do this. We are at home, they are playing 4-4-2 with two defensive midfielders. Could be a bit tricky. There we are. Lots of greenage. I love it. I love it, love it. We are attacking from the right. Pukabek has the ball. Uh, goes inside, passes out to the left. Um, oh yeah, that was an opening highlight. Nothing hardly ever happens on opening highlights. Uh, on the left now with the throw in is it going to be a cross? it is going to be a cross on the back um, uh, Pukrabek has the ball passes it in gets it back passes it backwards Utti chases it Utti takes it nice and hard and now it's a nice and long run there for Utti to get that ball but now Halein are attacking down on the right wing are they going to cross? yes they are they have obviously scouted our team. They know that that's our weakness. That's why, even though they had a two versus two opportunity, they run down the wing and tries to cross because they know that our center backs are utter shit on defending uh, crosses from the wings. But other than that, not much happening here on Austria Stadion. It's the last game before winter break. And I can't wait to um, dig deep into my loaded leagues and see what fruity gems I can find to our team to increase our defensive force. Um, because something has to be done. It It's not acceptable. I mean, it has been better the, this last few games. That's the case of death, isn't it? <laughs> now we're going to concede five. Uh, look at that green edge. He's finally learning to do team talks. I appreciate that because they've been quite mediocre. Um, now we're from the left, attacking to the right. Allen has the ball. It's an opening highlight, it's probably gonna end like no. Yeah, there we go. I got a bit worried. <laughs> um yeah, just over six hundred um 
fans, about 130 of them are highliners. Highliners, that's something else. Uh, are we going to counter? Here's um, Ayo Perdon has the ball on the left wing. Ayo Perdon uh, tries to, um, what's it called, cross it in. Didn't work. Now he has the ball again. No, that's a, that's a highliner. Not highliner, highliner. Our right centre back has the ball. Is he going to lose it? Of course he's not. Uh, but he passes it to a green and white, so he might as well have lost it. Pukabek to Angerer to Omerovic to Etty. Etty out to Pukabek. I think it could be our right back as well. Uh, Etty has the ball, passes it in, passes it forward, and it's a goal! Goal for Meyer! He's been complaining about not getting game time. I did give him a chance, even though I said he won't, he's really only playing because uh, Ergodan is injured. But maybe I have to reconsider because Meyer has been great these two, uh, three games he has played. This is the third, obviously. And now he scores a very important goal. We're still third in the league. Um, but we're still hanging in there. It's kind of a shame that it's just one promotion spot because it could be a very tight race. And that's why we need to strengthen up our team to make give ourselves that chance. I'm not going to make any substitutions. It's the last game before a long break. They better just get on with it. Angerer has the ball, passes it to Etty. Etty out on the left wing. Um, and we lose the ball. Uh, fantastic. Here comes Halein. The goalkeeper doesn't go out to get it, even though if he could. Halein comes one on one with the goalkeeper. He shoots and he scores. Um, Volonge scores for Halein. 1 1. Maybe I should have made my substitution to get some fresh legs. But hey ho. Uh, shoulda, woulda, coulda, as they say in England or whatever. That was a, a weird comment to make. But anyway, <laughs> uh, we're down to fourth in the league because we only got one point from Halein. And these are points we can't afford to lose in the long run. Um, if we stay in this league another season, it's simply going to be because of them kind of points. And I do. I expect then in the next season that we completely dominate this league if we stay here another year. Hopefully we won't. Um, but for now we played one one with Halein, which is a mediocre team, and therefore it's bulletin time. I'm gonna completely destroy the team aggressively. Gonna say some shit. There we go. There we go. Lots of red, as usual, when you have a massive go at them. Fantastic. Great. There we go. A bit of a bit of green, which is unusual. Um, but maybe some of them are realists and realize that they are utter crap today. Anyway, with ten games left of the season, we're in. In the question about automatic promotion to the Regional Liga, we are going to Region West, I do believe. Um, that's my chair, by the way, that sounds like that. Um, we're three points away from promotion with 10 games to go. It's all in our own hands. If we can sort that defense out during January transfer window, then it's all going to be lovely and obviously the next episode then is going to be obviously that depends completely on my business in January as you can see for some reason we're not able to make friendlies in January but hopefully that will change but at the minute I'm not able to make friendlies there we will be back for this game uh what was I saying yeah so the plan is 
with business in in January we're gonna be back with this one if it's no business then potentially I'm gonna play a few more and then come back for the Salzburg Derby on our own arena and then play them too um, I'm gonna think about what game I'm coming back but mo most definitely we are gonna see the next game of the league because we need business in January and then we're gonna have a transfer summary and one game then we're gonna jump ahead to SAK uh, potentially do them both and then do them both but yeah um, basically watch the next episode and see what happens thanks for um, for watching if you like this uh, episode and this um, and this series please uh, please drop a like because that helps um, not only me but the whole football manager community to grow is the um, YouTube algorithm but to uh, get completely fresh um, updates on when these this series are released please hit that subscribe button and also leave a comment that helps um, with the video growing as well but now I won't um, now I won't bore you with my nonsense talk about likes subscriptions and comments and I shall see you in the next episode Thanks for watching and until next time until next time take care of each other and bye bye